सो गाइज नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू ट्वेंटी प्लस टिप्स ट्रिक्स एंड हिडन फीचर ऑफ दिस असूस जैन फोन फाइव जी सो लेट्स बिगिन Hey what's up guys my name is Zaheer so in this video i'm going to tell you more than 20 tips tricks and hidden features of this Asus Zenfone 5Z so let's begin before starting this video guys i want to promote my instagram uh, my handle is tech buffet as you see over here just go ahead and follow me on instagram for more behind the scene and if you want to be my friend just go ahead and follow me on instagram with that said with that clear let's begin By the way, guys, I have already posted a lot of video on this smartphone. If you wanna see, I will leave a card over here, so you can definitely go and check that out. With that clear, let's begin. Now, guys, let's start the video. Uh, let me tell you all the tips, tricks, and hidden features of this smartphone. First of all, go to Advanced in the setting, then you will find this Game Genie option, and this is one of the best feature I have found in this smartphone. basically with this specific feature you can record your gameplay in up to 1080p resolution and also you can live stream your gameplay which is incredible with microphone that means uh, if you want to talk in your gameplay you can do that with this application and it is very amazing and it's free guys you don't have to download any other application while you want to stream your gameplay on the youtube or twitch if you want to live stream on that platform and when you play games uh, you will find a toolbar over here then after that you have this zen emoji option uh, this is also a kind of very good feature and very gimmicky too basically what you can do is uh, when you want to when you want to do a video call with someone let me show you guys as you see here guys this is what i'm trying to say is this is what an emoji can do and you have option over here to change your uh, any emoji thing so yeah um let me mute it so guys uh, this is what i'm trying to say and it's kind of very good feature and kind of gimmicky too so if you want to use it just use it and let me know what do you think about this feature in the comment section below then after that guys you have twin apps basically it's a twin app you don't have to download any other application to make a clone of your uh, own app which is uh, whatsapp messenger basically you can use two account of whatsapp in a single phone which is awesome right and uh, facebook and instagram and a lot of other things so yeah and then after twin apps uh, we move to the ai features you have lots and lots of ai features in this phone for example this optiflex basically what it does it uh, when you use certain app a lot of time it reduces the loading time of that app which is incredible and it works quite well in my opinion so yeah use this ai feature guys it's very good then we have uh, suggested app it's a normal thing then we have ai charging basically it charges your smartphone from 0 to 80 in the night then before you wake up it charges the battery 200% which helps a lot in terms of battery life now you have a smart screen uh, what it does it uh, like if you enable this it says all it extend the screen on time while you are looking at the device it's a very neat feature then we have ai ringtone it adjusts the ringtone volume according to your environment noise level so nice then guys after that we have kids mode it's a very basic thing if you want to enter this kid mode just enter any passcode four digit pin then uh, your answer and your some question then it will enter in a specific kids mode where the kids can use only certain application that you have provided in that kids mode it's a very neat feature for kids then after that we have easy mode kids mode is for kids this mode is for elder who has blurry vision or something like that it makes the icon bigger and it makes the text very bigger so they can easily read it then after that we have this one hand mode option uh, what it does it if you want to use your smartphone in one hand just double tap on the home screen and as you see here it becomes a one handed friendly smartphone so you can use it then after that go to security and lock screen then you have screen pinning option it's a very neat feature guys as you might already know that if you want to give your smartphone to someone else to use it 
for example if someone ask you to give your smartphone to, to watch some specific application for example instagram just open the instagram then press this button and pin it when you pin it it is not going to be back when you want to go back it is not going to go back as you see over here so guys if you want to unpin this app just uh, press and hold these two button together and it will lock your smartphone which is incredible thing after this uh, go to display then go to navigation bar from here you can uh, arrange this navigation bar basically you can change the system of this navigation bar if you want the back button on this side then you can do that from here and you have lots and lots of other modes and you have this hide navigation bar option with this you can hide the navigation bar awesome right now guys uh, after that uh, we have uh, let me go to audio department as you see over here guys we have this uh, audio wizard it's a very very awesome thing guys believe me uh, let me play some as you see over here it's playing please don't give me copyright strike and uh, if you want to like want some amazing experience you can uh, turn lot of thing on or off from here when you connect your earphones basically it's an equalizer on steroids so yeah with that said let's move on after that we have screenshot feature which is in advance then go to screenshot guys uh, from here you can enable how do you want to take a screenshot tap and always show recent tab basically when you want to take screenshot just press and hold this recent button and it will take a screenshot and you can also take longer screenshot by this if you have a, a longer page to capture and uh, you have option to change the format of screenshot if you wanna save the screenshot in png format then you can do that as well then after that we have a fingerprint gesture option enable this it's a very neat thing if you want to see the notification just swipe down with your fingerprint on the fingerprint sensor and you will get a notification as you see over here like this right it's very neat feature you can definitely try it now let's move to some another amazing features guys and go to home screen then pinch in with two fingers then you get this preference option go to this option then go to home screen you can customize your home screen with this and it has lots and lots of customization option for example if you don't want app drawer just enable this and it will change all the settings and then uh, you can change the grid size you can change lots and lots of things over here you can also apply custom icon packs from here which is nice right as you see and after that you have app lock guys uh, you don't have to download separate app lock in this smartphone if you want to use app lock you can lock your application from here you have to first enter your password whatever you have set and uh, skip for now uh, you can lock any application that you want like for example i have locked the amazon for example now if i want to use the amazon app i have to use my fingerprint to unlock the amazon app so it's a nice feature guys you can use it you don't have to download a separate application for the app lock system so yeah with that said uh, you can also hide the apps too from the home screen as well as from the app drawer which is a nice thing so yeah you have lots and lots of feature in this phone and with this zen ui now let me tell you some more feature then i will wind up this video this is a fan favorite zen motion guys you have double tap to turn off and double tap to wake up flip to mute hands up uh, and uh, you have lots and lots of gesture for example if i want to open the camera just if i draw c it will open the camera nice right and uh, if i want to lock my phone when i double tap on the empty screen it will lock it and when i double tap it will open and with the help of face unlock it opens quickly without reaching the fingerprint and by the way guys the fingerprint speed and the face unlock speed is very quick in this phone so i'm impressed here my every tips and tricks video i have told you that go to advanced go to build a number and uh, tap the build number seven time then you find a developer option in the system just go to developer option just turn it on and uh, find the animation scale put the uh, put all the animation scale on 0.5 guys then it will make your smartphone way faster and way snappier than uh, the previous time after that guys you have edit home screen option from here you can 
change the alignment of the icon you have scroll effect basically you can change the scrolling effect of the screen and uh, you have icon label color you can change the color of your icon uh, as you see over here the color of the text is changing with this thing and then you have font you can change the font of icons awesome right it has lots and lots of features guys right? you have folder theme how you want to see your folder for example like this or stack on a card you have lots and lots of things guys i am impressed here with the features that zen ui provides in the zen phone 5z so yeah these are all the tips and tricks that i have found in this phone for you guys what do you guys think about this video it is helpful or not if it is helpful then hit that like button right now guys and after hitting that like button share this video with your friends who are using any smartphone uh, which is running on zen ui or uh, who are using zen phone 5z please share this video with them yeah it will be definitely helpful for them and guys if you want to purchase a smartphone i will leave a link in the description box below from where you can purchase it and guys uh, if you find this video helpful and if you love my content then just hit that subscribe button with that bell notification icon so you will be notified when i post new videos like this one thank you so much for watching this video guys bye bye